Hey guys, uh, today we are going to be looking at the ambition of the new Android event. Now, this event came out on November 30th, so you know we have had a couple of days to let it stew, and I'm going to be able to give you an all-encompassing guide for all of the missions, just so you can make sure you can get this done in one run, you can get this done in two runs, or you can try and, you know, well, not even. It's going to take you one run, or it's going to take you two runs. So we're going to go ahead and quickly look at all the missions. I'm going to break them down, and we're not going to spend too much time on this, but then what we're going to do is I'm going to look through the categories on my box, and then you're going to kind of be able to work around and see if you can mix and match. And like I said, we're going to try and do this so we can get this done in one run. So that way you guys don't have to go back and play it twice. It'll take you, you know, eight minutes instead of, you know, 16 to 20. So with that being said, let's pan over over here. And we have the mission. So there's not really much to talk about here up in this beginning phases right here. You guys can see that we have uh, clear phase one, clear phase two, and then it's a seven phase fight. So th what I've noticed in my experience, because I've already completed this, uh, what I've noticed is this just feels like an infinite Dragon Ball history stage, so it should not be too difficult for most people to get this done. Especially, like, if you just want a completion, use your best team, you'll absolutely destroy it. But here's where things get a little bit special. We have uh, special conditions, and we have stuff like three really special conditions that we need to focus on. And the first one is three Android char uh, category characters, and then the second one is three crossover character uh, category characters. And then the last one is clear within 15 turns, but I do believe that if you run the right setup, that should not be difficult at all. So where this does get a little bit tricky is you can try to kind of kill two birds with one stone, right? So let's go ahead and pan back over to Dokkan here and go back in. You guys will see a team that I used right away, and that was the, or this was the second team that I used. This was the Heroes team uh, to take down the crossover uh, portion of this. But what we're going to be looking at is let's partially match it. So if you guys uh, are playing on global, it should be a little bit easier for you to find Android. That's this one right here. And then crossover is the one that's above heroes. So if we do a full match, there should only be really two characters here that I've noticed. Uh, so what we want to kind of do is, I think what we'll do, and I, I've said do a lot in these couple seconds here, but is take both of the Android 21 units, and then we will take this Android 18 linked unit and just kind of use her just for fun, right? That's the login unit. Um, um, yeah, now, ah, uh, this is so, where where you would really be kind of, uh, be helped out right here is if you had, uh, the Android, uh, what's the word, if you had, uh, Android 21, the Dokkan Fest, that would be extremely helpful for you here, but, uh, I do not as... I uh, just really didn't see much of a reason to go too hard on that banner. Uh, what I'm doing right now is pulling up the Android category so we can look at the leaders and try and figure out who the best lead would be for this specific setup. So we have uh, our Android leaders here. Obviously, you would have the Android 21. That's very good. Gamma 2 is a good leader. Uh, but uh, we have 170% of stats. So here's what I'm going to do. We are going to run Android 17. And now what we're going to do is make this a partial match. And so now we're going to take all of our Androids here and make sure that we make sure the first thing we do is we get every included that we need so this Android 21 we have the in Android 21 and then we have the physical linked Android 18 uh, just to make sure that we have everything that we need so now these are all the categories right here and so now we can kind of just play around with whatever other Android units that we want so um, breaking that down we have in cell I feel like would be a pretty powerful option but if we go to the event itself and we see just to make sure we have exactly what we need uh, we want to see uh, let's click on the details of this right here. Uh, the so I'm we'll, we'll switch back over real quick while we're talking about this. But we have uh, everything right here. It, it, it looks pretty nice. Uh, but we have the last phase is what's really important. We have in and STR. So what we want to focus on is kind of making sure that we have. Uh, we don't really need to worry about uh, physical. So we can bring in cell, and then I think I would want to make him a rotation, right? So we bring then this in cell, and then I would want to bring a good link partner for him, and that would be AGL cell because this is going to be a longer form event, so it should work out just fine. So if we refresh uh, the new LR androids, they are 100. Oh, they're key four, and okay, so yeah, that's actually let's let's do that instead. We'll bring this guy, this this guy because or these guys because they're new. Uh, they just easy aid over here on JP, but if you are on global, you can go ahead and use the physical Android 17 for the 170% to stats, but you will just be losing on one key, which I don't think will be massive, so don't worry about that too much. So here you go. Uh, this team, like we said, uh, it nails all three of the specific things. So right here we have Android 18, so Android, 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 and then crossover, 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 those three. So that is going to make sure that we have everything. Now, again, this is just a complete mission, so just in case we need it and I don't trust something, I'll bring a Ghost Usher to get rid of turns, and then we'll also bring a uh, cell cell will kind of fix the heal up item but let's just bring an android 8 just in case i don't plan on using those but it is possible that we do run into a bit of a complication so here's the team that we're rocking we have every mission taken care of right here so let's go ahead and get into the gameplay and we'll see how this kind of plays out with this specific team now 
I have not used this 21 in game yet, the 21 good right here. Uh, you, can, you can see her down there. Uh, I used her in chain battle, but that is not like a good gauge to see how she performs within the game. Uh, so this will kind of be my first look at her, uh, and we're not really going to get to see her on this turn because uh, Intel is going to go ahead and mop up 16, if I would have to imagine. Uh, checking her defense, we're at 124k on a 170% lead, so nothing to really write home about, but it is at least worth noting. Um, with this Intel, uh, he should just basically carry us through this whole event. Uh, and again, one big thing is like if you have Android 21, this will make your life a little bit easier, but this is an easy enough event to the point where if you don't have the Dokkan Fest, you really don't have anything to worry about, and that's kind of like the position that we're in here where we have, you know, three Androids, three crossover, and the team is still well, like, well off enough, right? So now this is where things get a little bit tricky. Let's go ahead and put the rainbow one in the front, 320k defense for them. Um, and most of the time you're going to be seeing them as this form because Android 16 is limited. Uh, you know, you really can only bring him out for a couple turns, uh, a couple turns at a time. So you, most of the time, like I said, you're going to be using this version. So there we go. Uh, 9.8 million right there. Yeah. So I would have to imagine this team is going to do a pretty decent amount of damage. Uh, just, just because of like our slot one units are just going to be so dominant. Cause like I said, we have Android 16, 17 and 18 right here. And then we've also got uh sell on the other side so really we just have two of these rotations that are just going to be a absolute beast of a setup so now you know <laughs> we have to wait for this guy to get to perfect but once he gets to perfect form we're really going to be chilling because that's a really solid rotation because this cell for me is a 79 percent and then obviously the cell you saw earlier is rainbowed so here you have four different bosses and they all if we go over here and look at their info uh i'll, I'll just kind of pull this up so you guys can see it while we're in the middle of the event we are looking at the clones right here, the first set of clones, and their super attacks are hitting for 132,000, which isn't bad at all, and you really shouldn't be taking much from anything, because these guys have like 50k on the normals and stuff like that, so defensively we should be good, but that is kind of where we're looking at for that, so let's go ahead and pan back to Dokkan now, and you see still the same run, but um, again, with the defensive numbers that we have on this team, we should have nothing to worry about, you know, 266k is going to be more than enough for what we're working with. Uh, what I should have done there, and I what I <laughs> I made a little bit of a mistake, but it's not really the end of the world. I should have taken uh, Cell off of Goku because he has a type disadvantage when he is attacking that Goku. Uh, but again, I don't think it's really going to be much of an issue because if Cell just hits a crit, that's the end of Goku's day. He has 4 million HP, so off a 10 million attack stat, even with the damage cut in half, he does have 52% damage reduction, though, which could be a little bit annoying, but we'll see. I'm just saying like we might not one-shot him. Yeah, so we wouldn't need a crit to one-shot him, and that's just because of the type disadvantage. So this is where it can get a little bit annoying, and this Goku does have the most HP out of any of guys on this phase. Uh, uh, like I said, Krillin's got 3.3, basically 3.4. Uh, Tian's basically got 3.6, and then Yamcha basically has 3.2. They have uh, so it's all like at the end of it is 96. So you just give them an extra 4K, we can round that up, right? Uh, but here we go. We have two phases worth of this. And then we're going to have uh, a lake of multiple enemies, and then we're going to go back to kind of the normal just fighting Android 21 for the rest of it. So we have four phases of Android 21 after this uh, kind of AoE portion, because the next one is going to be Vegeta, Trunks, Piccolo, and Gohan, and is going to be very similar where the HP is just cranked up a little bit, but the attack numbers remain about the same. So who links up better for, yeah, so Android 18 links up better for 17 and 18. Uh, we are basically camping at their 24 key, which is very nice, uh, won't be an issue whatsoever. And they, the slot one units, especially in this specific instance, should be able to Kind of just carry us through this you know at 9.3 million they could probably see a lot better i should see how many links they have active uh, after on the next rotation but we shall see uh the next rotation what i'm going to do is i'm going to put uh the transforming cell in slot one so that way we can activate legendary power on the int cell because the physical androids should be uh floating off here that would be that'd be ideal <laughs> well it's not ideal it, it's it, we don't even need it to be ideal because that's what's going to happen uh one thing to note i believe uh, yes, the STR-21. I'll pull that up when we get to this phase, uh, but she can lock you in place, and that is kind of like the only minor complication that we're going to have here. Uh, it, it's, it's not to the point where we have like uh, we have to worry about it, but it is something at least worth noting. Uh, we have two tech enemies here, so uh, Int Cell is going to put in a decent bit of work, and we'll just kind of continue wherever we left off with him. So there we go, 23 key on the androids. I don't know if you guys heard my headset turned off. It kind of jump scared me. Uh, but <laughs> it's, uh, our AGL cell is going to do his thing, probably going to hit close to 7 million, 6 million, yeah, 6.6. .6. Um, and he'll be just fine. And what we need is like two supers here from both of the cells, and we should be good to go. Uh, of course, we only get one from that cell, so now we have to uh, wait on the AGL. But 14 million right there, that's that power. That's the effect of legendary power and some of the extra links we're getting from AGL cell there. 12 million there. Only one super from each. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> All right, show me what you got. 
3.9, and then, ugh, yeah, that was so frustrating. We only took out two enemies there. Um, okay, okay, so now we have, if I put them in the middle, we have four links active, so obviously no legendary power there, and then 283,000 defense. Uh, let's go ahead and attack Gohan here. Uh, then we will go after Piccolo with you, and then hopefully uh, 21 can do like one to two supers, and that will kind of help us out just a tad with getting these guys down, and then we can start looking at the harder phases. I, I put in air quotes. Um, the hardest super attack that we're going to see in this specific run is 462,000. So not the most intimidating super attack in the world. Again, we've seen much higher uh, in other difficult content. I mean, we're talking about, you know, literally five times harder hitting supers in some of these red zone stages. So uh, we're more than well equipped. But now we are moving on to Android 21, uh, the first phase. So I just kind of want to break this down as we go. We are looking at this phase right here. You can see my cursor. Uh, we have uh, 8.5 million HP and then a 257,000 super attack. So most of the uh, super attacks, especially post super, are not going to be able to do any damage to us, and that'll make things very easy for us. So now, uh, just kind of want to keep up the trend here of putting AGL Cell in slot 1, in Cell in slot 2 to try and maximize his damage on Lynx, but I believe it doesn't even matter. Uh, just big bad bosses, yeah, obviously this 21 is not going to have Kamehameha and no legendary power as well. Uh, we have not seen this 21 do a super attack yet, but this is not her best setup by, uh, by any stretch of the imagination, but we should be good to go. Uh, this super is 257,000, so it should it could hit for like a little bit of damage because cell starter turn defense isn't great. Yeah, 8k there basically. Um, not the best, but it's all good. <laughs> not too worried about that. All right, so boom, here we go. If you crit, yeah, that's half her HP right there, and then we get a dodge, and then cell is going to go ahead and mop this up. Uh, 9.4 million should be good to go. Uh, let me make sure, and we'll just kind of keep panning back and forth uh, in between. Uh, the phases here so now that we're moving on to the next phase we know we have this agl android 21 transformed uh it's basically you know the version of the dokkan fest uh and she is uh just basically a scale up basically by everything here so it's like we have 800,000 more hp we have uh, 10,000 more attack and then the super is hitting for about 30 uh what is that 28k more roughly yeah 28k more so um then we'll uh we'll come back and you know, like uh here's basically the same thing it's just another kind of step up right 10 million hp uh 10k more attack and then uh about 100,000 more on the super attack so uh, don't really need to look at this anymore. Uh, you guys kind of get the idea, but the STR version of 21 is going to be the one that uh, locks you into place, and she has a 40% chance to do that. So just keep that in mind as you do play this one where that can potentially happen to you. Um, <laughs> worst case scenario, if you think it's going to be a death blow for you, uh, just make sure you bring a Senzu Bean. I should mention that. Um, if, you, if, if the lock ends up really killing you, make sure you bring a Senzu Bean. That is one, the best advice I can give you. Okay, let's see. Hopefully we can just take this out in one shot, but I doubt it. Uh, yeah, one super attack did a decent bit. I think by the time my uh, Android like Android Trio does their thing, we should be good. Okay, nice dodge uh, there. Uh, 4.3, uh, if maybe she can crit, would be in a good spot, but the type disadvantage here does not help. Uh, it's probably not gonna do a ton. Yeah, only 700k, or yeah, 700k damage, that 1,000 per normal, not great, but it's just that type disadvantage coming in there. Uh, but 8.4 million right here. Uh, this could do potentially do a decent amount of damage to uh, our girl 21. So the next phase is where the lock is going to come into play, and we shall see. I'm going to bet that my floating unit is put in the front. This 18 is going to get locked in the front. And this is not pre-recorded. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes you just know, right? So she has 112,000 attack, and then her super can do 392. She has 152,000. Uh, let's go ahead and pop an usher here, because I don't want to go back and run this again. There's no mission for the no item run. Uh, just a unfortunate break here. Uh, this is a link up, so we'll do this. And then on the next phase, we have extreme int. So again, just an, uh, like that's just what happens, right? Oh, and we got the Dokkan attack too. So this is a waste of a Dokkan attack. Yeah, a 2.3 million Dokkan attack. Unlucky. Uh, tight disadvantage and everything. Uh, we got lucky with the Dokkan meter going kind of slow. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. On to the next. But again, it, 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 it's it's like. Like I said, you don't really need, I didn't need to use an Usher there, but just something tells me I was going to take a super and it's just going to be a whole mess, right? So I'm like, let, let's just use the Usher, get it out of the way. Uh, let's not stress about this because it's just, uh, you know, a couple stones here on the line, but I want to make sure that I at least cover it. Uh, 7 million right there. And by the time that this is probably through, because we are type advantage right here, so this is going to do decent damage. Uh, yeah, 5.1 right there. And then hopefully if Cell can crit, we can move on to the next phase. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, there you go. Uh, no crit, but still done. Now, uh, this is the last phase here against 21 transformed uh, in the evil mode, and now you're going evil as well. Uh, the I'll let the transformation, while that's playing out, uh, here's what we're looking at right here. We have a 462,000 super attack, and then they also have 18% on the 
Uh, where's the damage reduction? We have 70% damage reduction, and they have an 18% chance to super, and then we have one super per turn, and then it cools down by 9. So, uh, 12 million HP, 132k on the attack, nothing too crazy. A 462k super, most of the team can survive here, so not too worried about that, but uh, just you guys will see. I'm moving some units around as I'm talking here, but this is what we have set up. So we have uh, the type advantage in the front, and then uh, we'll just kind of use the transform, the evil version of 21 there. And then maybe there is a potential where we just one shot this because uh, the Android duo or the Android trio. But um, again, this should be all she wrote, and that's all the missions. So 15 turns, more than easy enough. Uh, Android category units, easy enough, and crossover also covered for as well. No, so we are going to have one more turn. Um, it depends on how much this 21 does, but I can't imagine it's going to be anything too crazy. Yeah, 6.2 is not bad. If she crits, maybe. Um, but all the missions, there you go. <laughs> Again, I, 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 I meant to get to this a little bit earlier than I did, um, but all good. You guys uh, kind of get the gist. Uh, basically just an infinite Dragon Ball history stage against Android 21, but it has, a, it has some makeup on it, right? What's the saying? You put lipstick on a pig. That's basically what this is. 6.6 uh, .6 for a free-to-play unit, huh? That's pretty good. <laughs> She's hitting just as hard as the other one. And 2.3. Yeah, wow. Okay. Um, yeah, not really many. I can't really get cute with this finish. So we'll let the Android Trio take it away. Uh, 17 and 18. And if they don't sell, we'll mop up. Uh, but there we go. All missions for Ambition of the new Android taken care of. All that fun stuff. Uh, if we look at the total rewards while the super attack... Uh, I'll, I'll let you see. Uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll do it on the side here while you guys are watching this. But let me... Um, I'll count up the stones that we get in total. Oh, wow. Okay, Cell does get to clean it up. We got one, two, four. Uh, let's see. So one, two, four, six, nine, twelve, seventeen, twenty-one, <laughs> twenty-one, uh, twenty-three, twenty-five, twenty-seven, twenty-eight 21, 21, 23, 25, 27, 28 stones and an Elder Kai, a dozen, three dozen Kai and some other, you know, training items and whatnot. So there's all your missions for Ambition of the New Android. Uh, let me know down below what you guys think of this stage. Did you already beat it? Did you get all the missions? Uh, did you get it done in one run? Did you get it done in two runs? All that fun stuff. And if you did enjoy today's video, leave a like and subscribe if you are new so you don't miss out on any of my Dokkan content. Uh, my name is Vilify. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.